Okay, I'm back with this. Now let's see what we have. I was just using it for HDMI to see how it works. Anyways, so currently I'm sending a Bluetooth file over that, and if you can see, it's a file. It's seven percent sent because it's uh, more than 500 MBs, and sending it to the Infuse, which I'm using to film this. Let's see. How's this one is working? Settings. Power saver is off. Notice this. I didn't turn it on. All right. So only now it's giving me error on battery low. It's 15% remaining. Okay. Power saver. 15%. And battery use. See one by one. It's screen. Two hours twenty nine minutes. XDA twenty nine. Wi Fi thirteen hour three minutes. Android system. Browser seven minutes. Cell standby. Time without a signal zero percent. Gmail and the graph. So it's thirteen hour three minutes. Notice this small inclination. That is due to I was using MHL adapter and it was charging like one or two minutes. That's it. So overall, I think the battery is okay for moderate use, low to moderate use. It's not good for heavy use until now. And this is completely stock without any changes in the original OS. Everything is there, stock application, ATT stuff. No changes at all. So what I'm going to do is I will give it another go tomorrow. After removing some of these applications from AT&T and LG to see how it stacks up with everything else and somebody said that I didn't show application you can see applications everything is running smooth here I won't complain about the UI UI is fantastic and kudos to LG and, that, and uh, you can see some of these home settings I did try these options animations are currently off I did turn it off screen effects are panorama right now I'm using panorama but uh, it was breeze before now you can see it's like a breeze like air breeze or something and mm, what to show that's it for now I will be back with another video. Thanks for watching.